which is not a priority because there's no, I mean, there's budgets for everything else other than, you know, to make teachers' lives better. The state is sitting on more than one and a half billion dollars in surplus money, and some say teachers should get a chunk of it. We're glad you're joining us tonight at five. I'm Laura Monteverdi. Well, good evening. I'm Bob Claus and Kara Gifford's Andrew Epperson joining us now live in Little Rock with more on this. And Andrew, legislators say they likely won't address this in the upcoming special session, and it's not on the agenda at this point. But they're open to upping teacher salaries. Yeah, that's right, Bob. Though some legislators do say that the special session should be a time to address this. Now, starting teacher salaries here in Arkansas are less than what we see in surrounding states and districts in other states recognize that and are trying to poach educators. Drive around Little Rock long enough, you'll see this sign across the city encouraging Arkansas teachers to head to Texas for more money. It's enticing. Uh, I mean, my oldest son's got three years left of school, you know, so I probably won't make a transition until, you know, he graduates, but three years isn't that long. This man you teaches know, math at an Arkansas public school. He doesn't want to be identified because he's not sure how his district would react to his speaking out. We're just not a priority because there's no, I mean, there's budgets for everything else other than you know, to make teachers' lives better. He and others say the state should approve pay bumps for teachers in an upcoming special session that'll address how to use $1.6 billion in surplus money. We know that our teachers are, uh, particularly here in the state of Arkansas, criminally underpaid. Democratic State Representative Monty Hodges says he's all for bringing this up during the special session. Oklahoma, Missouri, Tennessee, uh, Mississippi just passed a, uh, a salary increase for their teachers. Um, all those salaries are higher than the state of Arkansas. I think every year that I've been in the legislature, except my first, which was under a Democrat governor, I think we have done some form of teacher pay increase. Republican State Senator Bob Ballinger says all legislators want teachers to make more money, but he doesn't think this is the right way to do it. It's not so much as not thinking that the teachers deserve a pay raise. It's a question of how how education dollars is being spent and why isn't it being spent in the classroom. The teacher I spoke with says even a one-time bonus would send the right message. I really just think they need to change their priority and put more emphasis on taking care of the teachers. Now, the teacher I spoke with says younger teachers in Arkansas are starting to leave the industry entirely, and if it keeps up the way it's going, we could see a widespread teacher shortage here in Arkansas. Live in Little Rock, Andrew Epperson, KRK4 News.